Howdy y'all, I'm Around the Wheel, you're watching Lemmings to the Tribes. Eleven and a half tribes down, one half of a tribe to go. And I hope today, this level looks really long. I'm kind of hoping Medieval shows a little bit of teeth today. So that maybe we only get through like two levels and it helps me out with some uh, end game pacing here. So let's play Twister. Well, guess what we're going to be doing? It looks like, oh, well, how about that? Look at that. Five Twisters. Who'd have thunk? Four minutes to do this one. Uh, everything else, five five of everything except platformers, which uh, may give us some leeway to do this in a few different ways. But this is an extremely vertical level we've got going here. So let's check it out. Let's play Twister like we did last summer. So, oh boy. Okay, this is quite the cramped little layout. This is a little less open than what we've seen so far. So if they go down into here, it looks like they're going to contain themselves pretty nicely for me, which is uh, appreciated. Uh, so let's see. They end up rock climbing and doing all manner of crazy stunts. Any jumpers? Yes, we have a jumper. So let's see how we can go about this. This is not the exit. This is a tipped over goblet, just FYI. So no stompers. Any digging we do is going to be exclusively a function of stomping. So we gotta be, we gotta be pretty quick. We gotta be kind of on the ball here. This looks like a trap. I see pixels here. This looks like a bear trap kind of sitting at an odd angle. I am kind of inclined to investigate. Let's go ahead and, uh, Okay, we've only got rock climbers, uh, which is a little bit annoying. Uh, a climber would definitely help a little more here. It would just go down and down and down and down and do the thing that I want. Um, so we would want to, I guess, twist once through here. I think a rock climber might actually get up here successfully, which might prove to be a problem would kind of send them in an endless loop. Maybe the better place to go is here. Send the lemmings through here. Then twist down again. Get one guy going over this way. All right. I think I'm I think I'm seeing the idea here. But yeah, I want to see how that trap goes first. Let's let's blow you down. Well, blow me down. Literally. That was Absolutely awful, and I do not apologize for it. Let's go ahead then. You're going to go down here. Mm, yeah, I want to see what this... This is almost certainly a trap, but I just want to see it in action. Oh, I thought it was like they would walk up on him. <laughs> oh, it's a little, uh, it's a little dragon head. Boy, he is... Uh, uh, I'm around the wheel. You're watching Torchy's Tacos. Here we go. All right, so yes, uh, that is a trap. That is a known quantity. Mm, I'm fairly certain the platformer is going to go here. That's the only place it makes sense for it to be, unless coming from over. Here. Yeah, they would have to. They would almost certainly have to drop onto here, and then you would bring them down into here by twisting, by twist digging here. Blup, blup, blup. Yeah, that's that's what makes sense to me. I'm gonna I'm gonna go ahead and roll with it. Let's let's go ahead and get them into a. Let's go ahead and let one lemming actually be a rock climber slash. Let's go ahead and assign the slider activity now, so that we can get this kind of going. Actually, I think. With a little bit of judicious twisting, we can actually no get get over some. Yeah, there we go. We can actually avoid all this mess altogether. Now I just have to be a little careful with how I twist. Oh, he got he got deadified. I did not pay attention to where he was gonna be, and things just kind of ended up badly for him. Okay, so okay, move you over a little. Uh, yeah, move you over a little bit. Okay, and then... No! That gets everybody down to there! That's exactly where I didn't want you to go! Yeah, I kind of wanted to just twist around here. 
Yeah, see, like, this little twisty path that I'm... Whoa, that was intense. But, uh, okay. I think I kind of get the idea, though. Yeah, I want to... I want to watch... I want to watch where he's going for... I can work with the twister anytime I want. Which means they're safely contained in here, and I just gotta kind of work my way around. So I can work with one that goes ahead. I mean, I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna go ahead and do that. Let's see what happens here. So... I did not really pay much attention to the rock climber's trajectory. But I'm gonna do that now. Let's see what that gives me. Okay, you're gonna go here and blue. Okay, that makes you fall there. And you're going to climb, hit your head. This must have been where he got in trouble before. Okay, so he slides down here. Maybe sliding is not the best idea. Because he's gonna fall down to the right now. Maybe I should just jump over the trigger point? How about that? Let's give that a shot. It's probably smart business. Here we go. Okay. So just wait and don't hop directly onto it. There we go. We avoided waking up the dragon. I'm around the wheel. You're watching Don't Wake Daddy. So whichever way I go here is just fine. Okay. So here... Okay. Herein lies a problem. Okay, yeah, I would have to use a platform here. Oh, we have a, we have runners too. That's that's an interesting idea. In fact, it's interesting enough that it makes me inclined to think Okay, can you just clear a pit and climb up it? Whoa! Oh, I didn't know that was possible. That's amazing, but I don't think you're going to get over that. That, that kind of presents a problem in itself. Oh, no it doesn't. <laughs> okay. Oh man, very nearly avoided a death in the pits. Okay, I'm enjoying this level quite a bit, I have to say. But he's only got so long to do his thing. So this is probably when I want to start sending a twister along. The twister, the twister will just kind of do a thing. Okay, now I need to watch you for a while. Okay. Alright, so yeah, you're running. He's running, so yeah, I have to get him going. The twister will be there for me. He'll just twist until they never get too dizzy and like puke or something. Okay, yeah, here's a, here's a fun part. Whoa! <laughs> oh, I love it. And here's where, yeah, here's where this goes. Very good. Okay, so you're going to do that, so I have a little more time. They're all in the pit now, so this is actually it's actually worse to my advantage. I can just go straight down. Uh, okay, did he hit the wall? Okay, yeah, he hit the wall. I thought it was about time to check on him. So, oh gosh, yeah, this level is a little blast right here. Okay, so you go down, zoop, okay, and then he will get in the goal. I should hear a yippee any day now. So, okay, we want to dig you straight down. Just keep you all together in a little grouping. There we go. And then we only have to do it one more time, and it doesn't even have to be that big a twist. Okay. All right, so we'll just, uh, we'll just blow you straight down. There it is. Okay. Oh, man. What a satisfying level. Oh, I enjoyed that one. That one was a whole lot of fun right there. All right. It wasn't necessarily hard, but uh, I think if I had not figured out the running and jumping bit and then rock climbing up that way, I always forget that the rock climber is a little more versatile than the climber. It's, it's kind of a thing you need to believe in. But yes, ooh, that level gets a big, that level gets the big, Foam finger, Uncle Roundy, thumbs up. I really liked that one. Hopefully the next one can live up to that one's high standard. I see no reason to believe why it won't be all capsing at my face as well. Underground. It's like the same person made all these levels. Or at least named them. Underground. 
everything's heavy underground, so I hear four of everything. Four, 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 four minutes. The underground gang of four. Here we go. So, what have we got going here? All right. Let's take some notes from the underground, and let's do this. Okay, everybody is safely contained. That's always the kind of start that I like to see. So, it's just kind of... Okay, we've got a cannon down here. Why down here? Makes me think we're gonna be using it, but... Okay, so we could, like, fence and just sort of stomp to the end? Uh... I don't really see anything keeping us from... Is this really as easy as it looks? I see some filling action happening here. Um, let's try just winging it. Okay, so playing by ear here. Playing strictly by ear. Four fencers. Okay, so you're going to fence probably up eventually probably gonna end up stopping yourself I think that's that's a pretty shallow upward climb but I think it's still gonna result in stopping before the next no it doesn't okay well that's interesting so I guess what I want you to do then is all right I'm gonna time to do some geometry here I'm gonna go ahead and stomp okay now, getting the stomper to do what I want might be easier with the game paused. No, the stomper just kept going. Uh, well, I was having su some success with that initially, so I may need the attractor. I was going to try to do it all on the fly, but it doesn't look like I'm going to have too hard a time here. I can just go straight across the top. Okay, you're going to keep going. Wow, yeah, if I stomp low enough, I can do this very easily. And then just walk and f one more fence? That's seriously it? This is all just for looks around here? What's, what's the big idea, Buckwheat? Let's, uh... Okay, let's do it up right, I suppose. Okay, so we need you to... Okay, we need you to jump away from your... Well, we'll keep the attractors to a minimum. Okay, so... Yeah, jump. Don't... Don't just turn around. Okay, well... I guess he's just gonna turn around. Alright, this is a... This is a bit of a stickiness. So, go ahead and... Yeah, right there. And then jump away. Still... Still into it. Okay, he got close enough to tickle the wall with the foil. Very nice. So he can keep on going. So I don't think I'll need any more jumpers from this point. What a ridiculous level. That's that's just bizarre. Like, is it meant to be like that? I, I sincerely hope there was some kind of challenge there that I just happened to cheese. But I was just, I was just going with it by looks. But, you know, whatever, I guess. So let's fast forward through here. This should be safe from... Yeah, I was going to say, this should be safe from dipping down into there. Yeah, we're not going underground at all. We're staying mostly at the surface for this one. There doesn't seem to be much need to run around and make this all complicated. Why Why do that when you can just... When you can just hop your way to the end here. When you can just take a sword and solve all your problems with that. Why not just... Why not just do that? There we go. Okay. All right. All right. So on your way, on your way then, and uh, I guess jump to free you. It's a straight line to the exit. Wow. Wow. What a spectacularly easy level. No catch whatsoever. I mean, I guess you could try to work out a path, but through here. But why not just make it as easy as you possibly can? Let's fast forward this. I'm a little bit disappointed after the after the rush that the that the last one gave me. I was really I was really pleased with that uh, with that last one, but I guess you know we're, the later we're getting into the tribe, the more maybe the game feels like packing it in as well. Maybe the game is just like you know it's the end for me too. We're gonna go ahead and do one more, and I think that should leave two levels for next time. Maybe three. I forget how I blocked this out what shall we do now 
we'll probably just have another easy solve. We've got quite a few of each task, uh, which always points to a somewhat non-specific solution. Although two ballooners, I think the ballooner may actually get some use here, seeing as that's the only thing we have a limited stock of. So let's go ahead and do it. Let's go ahead and see, in fact, what we shall do now. Let's turn that question mark into a, a period, not a pyramid. That was that was 11 tribes ago. So let's see. Yeah, yeah. This is a this is a pretty it's a pretty big passage to balloon up through. I, I see you there, Mr. Dragon. Don't think I don't. So a stomper. I think probably the best way to handle this. We're gonna need to contain them somehow. I only have attractors. That's that's a good idea. So let's go ahead and uh, get somebody stomping, and the stomper can go while the attractor just plays the music. What are you doing? That's not a what? Uh, what's happening here? Okay, somebody like phased out of existence for a minute. That was weird. I think, I think we are crossing the streams, which I believe you're not supposed to do. Okay, there we go. Alright, so they're just going to play... Okay, play them out. Play them out, Paul. So now, what have we got here? We got ten platformers. Okay. Maybe should have left everyone up here. Although, no, we can make a bridge ourselves. It shouldn't be too bad. We've got ample room for the ballooner, which is convenient. So, platform, platform, go over here. Once he gets close enough, he can start platforming over to his friends, and then they can solve the rest of it themselves. Okay, yeah, this is pretty simple. This is pretty simple. So, yeah, you just bop down in there, and now it's time. Yes, indeed. We even have a spare balloon if we somehow... Screw up with this one, although we have a lot of room. I don't think that's going to happen. We can, if we take a gentle feather touch here, I think we'll be just fine. Okay, and then let's, uh, then hard bop over. There we go. That didn't even, that didn't even necessarily take a whole lot of finesse. So there we go. All right, so you go over here now. Patch this up. I guess I didn't look very much at what we have in the way of other... Oh yeah, I can't really I can't really do it that way, I don't guess. Okay, there is a tar pit here. Well, I thought I'd be able to get him out going this way, but maybe not. I didn't really pay attention to my task load very well. I've got bombers. Can five bombers get through a wall? We're about to find out. Okay, that's gonna that's gonna patch it up in one, which gives me a lot of confidence. Okay, that we could get through here in five bombers potentially, but I'm gonna have to get really, I'm gonna have to get really close on these, on these bops. Okay. Okay. So go ahead and be a bomber, be a bomber, be a bee. Here we go. And one more for good luck, please. Yeah, they ought to be able to make their way up that. Okay, very good. Okay. We made ourselves a makeshift tunnel. So now, all we gotta do... Oh, I don't like where he ended that. Oh, maybe I should have had everybody going like... Ooh, this is gonna get nasty. Okay, so I'm gonna do somebody who's not... Yeah, he should be able to patch up. Okay, yeah, get somebody who's not actually playing the instrument. Very good. Okay, and now we can free you of your of your minstrel duty. Very good. Okay, and now we can stomp to the end. Okay, all right. That was a pretty simple one to play out by ear. I, I liked that one. So let's go ahead and stomp to the end. Make sure to do it in different spots so that nothing too bad happens to anyone. And there we go. And it's done. Little Okay, a little ouchy. A little ouchy, but that's okay. So, that's it, I do believe. Next time, we are going to do the final levels of Medieval. 
And then that's going to do it. Hopefully the ending cinematic works. I never showed the intro because the intro cinematic actually hung up at a certain point. But I hope the... I hope whatever ending video there is works. And that we get to see the proper ending in all its glory. And then, yeah, I'll give my final thoughts. And we will have that notch on our belt. And we will be done next time. The finale of Lemmings 2 the tribes i'll be there with bells on